Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rafi Chowdhury here with RafiChowdhury.com and today we're going to be talk, making another YouTube video. We're going to be talking about dating and relationships as we have been for the past few weeks and today's topic is going to be um, breakups and can a breakup actually be a good thing for your relationship? The short answer to that question is yes, it can sometimes. The the answer that I want you guys to take home with you is that no, typically you don't want to break up with someone just to improve the quality of your relationships. So let's go ahead and break this thing down just a little bit further. So the first question I would ask myself is why am I breaking up with somebody? What's the deal behind it? Is there a reason why we're breaking up now? Um, if the reasons are things like um, there's some sort of like cheating involved, if if you're breaking up because... Um, you guys just don't see eye to eye on certain very, you know, big issues and things of that nature. By all means, those breakups happen, and 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 once they happen, that's it. You know, they, there's nothing more to it. But but really, like a breakup, if you think about it, it's just like you telling someone else that that you know that you're like you kind of see them, kind of you see yourself with them, but you don't really see yourself with them. It doesn't really make a whole lot of sense why you'd be breaking up and then getting back together again, right? But there are some cases uh, where it does make sense. For example, if you guys have situation like where you guys just can't commit time to each other com- properly for the time being, you may decide to take a break in your relationship. You guys are still committed into each other, but you're um, kind of you know giving it some time, and you guys are kind of maintaining a friendship while you guys both work out your um, your situation. This particularly makes sense when you guys know that you guys are kind of both. Um, you know, meant for like you guys are both committed to each other and you guys will continue to stay loyal to each other, but you don't want to necessarily commit yourself to that particular person in this in the, in the context of a relationship at that particular time. In that case, I think it makes a you know, it makes perfect sense for you guys to go ahead and take a break, um, and just kind of revalue it and figure out like your time commitments and things of that nature. The other time that I think it might make sense to take a break is if you are geographically not able to. Uh, see your partner for some length of time, then you guys may consider taking a break so you don't have those sort of like commitments that are required in a relationship um, that you would have if you are like, you know, in a full-time committed relationship with each other. Uh, Another scenario where I think a breakup might make sense is if you guys are having some like financial difficulties or some other hardships in life that might be affecting your relationship. Now, personally, I would recommend, I, I, I would think that those kind of things would bring people closer to each other and would actually help you uh, be more well-connected to your partner. But again, I can totally see how, like, you know, you don't want to bring the other person into your own pro- personal problems and things of that, of that nature, especially if it's kind of early on in your relationship. So in those cases, you may also want to consider taking a break, but just make sure no matter what the situation might be that you guys both commit and understand that if you're taking a break, you're not going to be seeing other people. Because if that's the case, then there is no need for you to take a break. You might just as well end the relationship and call that your end. Because if you are opening yourself up to other people and other other potential uh, partners that you could be talking to and things of that nature, it, it's just not a healthy situation in my opinion and the opinion of others as well to continue to call that a relationship and take a break, so to speak. So if you're going to be taking a break, make sure that you stay committed to your partner, that you guys are taking a break in the sense that, you, you know, you're just kind of taking a break in terms of like the time commitment or geographically you're not seeing each other or like the daily commitments that are required, not required, but sort of sort of like that are kind of given or you guys have both mutually agreed in that relationship. You just kind of ease off that a little bit so that, you know, one one partner or the other doesn't feel like they're obligated to do certain things uh, they have been, even though they're not able to commit to that at the moment. But for the most part, you know, my honest opinion on this is that although I do think that the breakups can have some benefits and they can be a good thing and, and, and relationships could definitely work after a breakup, you know, especially after you guys have both spent a couple of years maybe away or something like that and, and kind of come back and